Hello kids, how are you? I hope you all are good. Today we are going to start with our new chapter that is your chapter 6. Introducing PowerPoint 2016. So PowerPoint in short we say PPT. You must have seen PPT in we use in educational purposes, in meetings, in business for training purposes. So we make presentation with slides we work on for various purposes we use that. So in this chapter we will learn to make presentation. So let's begin with starting PowerPoint 2016 parts of PowerPoint 2016 window changing the slide layout saving the slide inserting objects in the presentation saving a presentation closing a presentation opening a presentation slideshow so let's just start the chapter kitty what are you doing i am making a presentation for my next project what is a presentation sit with me i will tell you about the powerpoint a powerpoint presentation is a presentation created by using microsoft powerpoint software the presentation is a collection of individual slides that contain information on a topic. PowerPoint presentations are commonly used in business meetings and for training and educational purposes. Starting PowerPoint 2016. Click on the Start button. The Start menu will appear. Click on PowerPoint. We can also type PowerPoint in the search box and press the Enter key. The Start screen of the PowerPoint window will appear. Click on the blank presentation. Appear titled as Presentation 1 PowerPoint. It is its default name. Parts of the PowerPoint 2016 window. Quick access toolbar. Title bar. Ribbon. Slide pane. Status bar. Changing the slide layout. Click on Home tab. From the Slides group of the Home tab, click on the Layout option. Many slide layout options will appear. Click on the layout design you want to apply to the slide. The layout of the slide will be changed. Saving the slide. Click on the file tab. The backstage view will appear. Click on the save as button. The save as dialog box will appear. Click on browse. Navigate the folder in which we want to save the presentation. Type a name for the presentation and click on the Save button. PowerPoint 2016 will be saved and the name will appear on the title bar. Inserting objects, click on the Insert tab. From the text group, click on Text box. Click on the slide where you want to add text while holding and dragging the mouse. A box having cursor will appear. The ribbon settings automatically change to Home tab and we can select the font style, color and size from here. Type or paste the required text. To insert text in the placeholder, click inside the placeholder and type or paste the text. Do you know? Click on the Insert tab. From the Images group, click on the Pictures option. The Insert Picture dialog box will appear. Click on the picture that you want to insert in the slide. Click on the Insert button. The picture will be inserted. Inserting a new slide. Click on the Home tab and then on the Slides group. From the Slides group, click on the drop-down arrow below the new slide. Slide layout window will appear. Click on the layout you want for your slide. If you want the new slide with the same layout, click on New Slide option from the Slide group of the Home tab. New slide with the same layout appears. Saving a presentation. Open the File menu. Click on Save as or Save option. A dialog box will appear. Select the drive folder where you want to save the presentation. Write the name of the file and click on Save button. Closing a presentation. Click on the File tab. Click on Close. Opening a presentation. Click on the File tab. Click on Open. A dialog box will appear. Select the location of the file and write the file name. Click on the Open button. The file opens. Slide show. Click on the slide show tab. From the slide show group, click on from beginning to view the entire presentation. However, 
If you want to view the presentation from the current slide onwards, click on from current slide. Use arrow keys or click on the left mouse button to move from one slide to another. Click on the exit option at the end of the slides to exit the slide show. You can press escape key to exit the slide show anytime.